Welcome to the Alabama Homestead. Today we'll be talking about chores. Welcome back everyone. We're here talking about our favorite thing to do on the homestead. Abby, what is one of your favorite things to do on the homestead? Riding my bike. Riding your bike. Notice what she didn't say. Our favorite thing here to do, chores. Okay, so chores isn't our favorite thing to do here. Obviously, we enjoy doing a lot of things around the homestead, but chores is not one of them. However, everybody has chores to do. It is no different on the homestead. In fact, there's probably a little bit more that we have to do than we normally do. We go home, we wash dishes, we do our laundry, get prepared for the week, all that kind of stuff. Those are chores. Some chores you get paid for, like going to a job. Uh, other chores, you've got wood chips to shovel into the back of a uh, Polaris. That is not so fun, but it is a chore. It is something that we will enjoy in the long run, so it needs to get done. All right, so Abby and I are going to get started on filling this thing up. Like I said, we've got a lot of compost that we're going to need for our uh, future gardens. We're going to start filling this up again, and uh, we'll see you with our next chore. Fun fact, the word chore comes from an old English word called char. char meant an odd job. All right, that's more material for the compost pile. Abby, how was it? Not easy. Not easy? Well, was it any fun? No. No? <laughs> no fun at all. Well, some things, they're just not fun, but they are necessary. One chore that's not so bad, seeing how many eggs we've got. It's actually a pretty fun chore. It's a nice guessing game. Over here. Let's see. All right, Miss Abby. You want to check? Yep. Yeah. more eggs. We got one? Yeah. Jeremy and Pop might have already done it. Oh. Catching the chicken. I want to hold the chicken now. Supposed to hold the chicken now. Hi, chicken. Alright, put her back in the cage. <laughs> Third chore done. We did it. Woo! Yoke got on my hands. <laughs> I, I dropped the egg. <laughs> I dropped the egg. If you guys aren't aware, chickens are hard to catch. They're not real fun to run after. What do you think about that, Abby? Ah! Was it better than shoveling? Sure. <laughs> so one of the things that we were gathering today, uh, we had a couple of muscadines. Uh, they're pretty good right now. I tasted one a couple minutes ago. It was very sweet. Enjoyed that. What do you think of muscadines, Abby? You like them? So we actually have a lot of work to do to get caught up on these muscadines where we want to have them. We have two or three rows of muscadines. And as you can see, they are very overgrown. Uh, pretty soon, once the foliage dies off, that'll be another chore. We'll come in, we'll clean all this up, get everything down to the main beans, and that way we'll be able to uh, have a better yield for next year. Good. 
So on this property, we have two Chinese chestnut trees. Uh, the reason they're Chinese chestnut is because American chestnuts got wiped out by a blight. So we have Chinese chestnuts. We are going to figure out what we can do with these. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions below, please comment down in the comment section. Uh, big prize to the first person who says roast them on an open fire. All right, so opening these chestnuts, I have very nice gloves on because I do not want to get pricked by these little spines here. They hurt a lot. So when we open these up, we said that we have these chestnuts in here. Abby, do you remember stepping on a chestnut? Yes. Yeah. What did that feel like? Terrible. Terrible? So. flip flops on. Oh yeah, that's right, she had flip flops on. So I know it's bad to step on Legos, but guys, have you ever stepped on a chestnut shell? That's a, that's a whole lot of heartbreak. So we got a nice little haul for now. Uh, obviously there will be more on this tree. There are a bunch more uh, that are green. They're gonna be ready pretty soon. So we'll get those going. Whenever they fall down, we're not gonna pick them with their green. We're gonna wait till they turn brown, fall on the ground. Then we'll crack them open and go from there. All right, we found an apple. Gonna pick that real quick. That's gonna be a nice snack. Right now, I am about to pick a persimmon. <laughs> it won't get off. I got it. <laughs> we are having great success with snacks. These were the fun chores. I'm about to eat the pear. Is it yummy? Yes. Is it juicy? Yes. Is it sweet? It's a little. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed our video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell. We'll see you next time. There's dirt in my boot.